Hello friends, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today we are going to discuss the article that has been published today only the 6th of January 2020 that the Chalakare to be the ISRO's astronaut training hub. So you can see here in the picture a view of the area where ISRO and DRDO facilitates will be set up at Chalakare. So plan is ready for space flight center to come up at the sites in Karnataka, Chittadurga. India's world class facility for training astronauts will come up not in the space headquarter in Bangalore nor in any glitzy metropolis. It will be established in three years at Chalakiri, a shrubby arid oil seed towns on the Bangalore Pune National Highway 4 in Chittadurga district of Karnataka. The Indian Space Research Organization has proposed a Rs. 2700 crore master plan to create top infrastructure that will house its young human space flight center. Dr. K. Sivan, ISRO's chairman and secretary, Department of Space, told that everything connected with events and planning of the HSP, the human space flight program, will shift to our campus at Chalakiri. We want to establish a self-contained facility there so that in future whatever training and activities we are now doing in Russia for the Gaganyan crew can all be done as here only. When, uh, when it get ready, the 400 acre ISRO land at Chalakiri will be the single stop consolidation infrastructure and activities related to space travelers. The country is paying a hefty unmanned sum to use such facilities abroad. The first set of four astronaut candidates for the first Gaganyan mission of 2020 are to train in Russia. The amount sought for the HSFC is over and about 10,000 crore rupees approved budget of Gaganyan. Pending its approval, the center may take two to three years at the earliest to be set up but would come up after the first Indian crewed flight. Scattered across the center as the currently human space program work is split across various centers such as Vikram Sarabhai Space Center in Tiruvananthapuram that you had seen you have seen in the left side of the image and the right side image is the UR Rao Satellite Center in Bangalore. The Institute of Aerospace Medicines of the Air Force has been dropped in for the selection basic and final training in Bangalore. Apart from all this work, Chalakare will also host work related to crew and the service modules of the spacecraft that carries the astronaut and up to mission control. So many more missions were there, such full-fledged facilities, Dr. Sivan said, were needed within the country as the HSP would not be a one-time affair with one Gaganyan project. We are going to have a sustained HSP and will need a large number of facilities for training our future astronauts. The ISRO has sought the amount outside the rupees 10,000 crore budget of Gaganyan and awaits for the government's approval of its proposal. The HSFC was formally announced in January 2019 and worked from a temporary place at the ISRO headquarters Andariksh Bhavan. As Onin Krishna Nair has been named its former director and R. Hutton as the project director of Gaganyan. Beyond that, the center is tasked with pursuing human future human space mission, completed the mission planning, developing engineering system for survival and safe return of the crew from space, as also selecting and training the astronauts. Querian unit is a human focused infrastructure apart. The ISRO was pl also planned to add a quarantine facility at the second launch pad in the Sri Harikota Space Center. Dr. Sivan said it would ensure that astronauts who were about to enter the spacecraft before the launch stay unexposed. Among many human related projects, the SLP and the launch vehicle GSLV MK3 will also be modified suitably for crew safety and comfort. In the science city, the Chalakare is about 400 km and over 3 hours by road from Bangalore, is also where the premier scientific establishment have set up adjoining an interactive campus on some 10,000 acre. Called the science city, it houses facilitates for ISRO and defense 
Research and Development Organization (DRDO), Advanced Aeronautical Test Test Range, Bhabha Atomic Research Center, and the Indian Institute of Science. So, four candidates, four male pilots of the Indian Air Force in their 30s and early 40s, are scheduled to leave for Moscow in the third week of January to train in Yuri Gagarin Cosmonaut Training Center for 15 months as the candidates for Gaganyaan. They were selected through basic fitness and health test at the Indian Air Force Institute of Aerospace Medicine in Bengaluru. In Moscow, they will learn the skills of life and survival in narrow capsule before, during and after traveling away from the Earth's gravity while managing the travel around the Earth. So guys, I hope you liked this video. If you did, do like, share and comment your views and don't forget to subscribe my channel.